hello good morning welcome back to my channel it's tisha today i gotta show y'all something let me show y'all something that's my freezer we don't have any food really <laughs> the slab of ribs i don't know why i bought them i think it was on sale a whole lot of nonsense but no meat really got some salmon ice cream here for the kids i don't know what that is but uh, but anyways a, a lot of stuff that shouldn't even nothing so today i'm going to the meat store so i can stock up so i like to do my shopping at the meat market because i save money that way instead of buying the packs of meat at publix and walmart and, and stores like that that can be very expensive for me um like i said i'm a single mom of five so I don't have them kind of funds to spend like that. So I gotta make my money stretch. So we're going to the meat store today. Before I get started, go ahead and hit subscribe and tune in. Let's see what deals we find in here. Is this a good one? This one. Uh, I need some scallions for tonight. It's cold. It is cold in here. I hate when chicken drumsticks are this big. That's just ridiculous. Some kind of steroids or something give it to the chicken. I, I, I don't buy chicken like that. That is good. It is real huge. They have family plans, like family bundles, but I never, ever, ever, ever buy those because it's just not enough. And some of them have the meat that come with it. I don't eat. They do let you substitute, but the substitutes be more stuff that I don't like. Okay, so take a look and see some of the plans they have here. See, like that one is not enough. So I don't buy these because when I buy them, I buy more than that. This one comes with five pounds of ground beef, five pounds of pork chop. Normally when I buy my ground beef, I buy 10 pounds. Same thing goes for the pork chop, the chicken wings, all that. I buy 10 pounds of everything. So they let you substitute. But when they, oh my gosh, look at that pig right there. I just noticed the pig. <laughs> oh, no, it's not alive. It's dead. So this is something many prices right here. Oh, they sell the whole thing. They have it. It's between ninety-five and twenty-five pounds. But it's terrible. So expensive now. The price went up on these dresses. Okay, everybody. They have 10 pounds of ground beef. I'm going to make a, a large order. Okay, so everything I tell you, I want 10 pounds of. Um, ground beef. 10 pounds. Yes, 10 pounds. I should get some oxtail. I'm going to get some oxtail too because my son asked for oxtail. He wants some oxtail. They tore that down a pound here. But I'm gonna go ahead and get 10 pounds because he did. I meant five pounds, five pounds. Because he did ask for those are good. He asked for some oxtails one day with some potatoes and carrots. So I'm gonna get that for him. Yes. I didn't realize he didn't speak English at first, so. Oxtails. Cinco. They ain't got no center cut pork chop, so I'm gonna have to go ahead and get and cut. We haven't had pork chops in a while, so I'm gonna go ahead and get some. But they are out. Wait, he might be cleaning and putting some more in here. Let me see. Maybe. Yes. Yeah. Okay, so those chicken wings are still expensive. Um, I did buy 10 pounds just so we could have some at the house. They have a deal on this. Um, 
you buy five pounds at six ninety nine, you get five pounds free. They do that with certain meats only. So I am gonna take advantage of that and get ten pounds of drumsticks for seven bucks, and I'm gonna get ten pounds of the chicken thighs. Hope y'all, y'all eat this cow feet. I mean, they had a chicken feet in the pig feet, so you know, a cow tongue. They sell cow tongue. Where? Um, in meat stores. They probably have it here, but I don't eat that. Alright, let's see. I want to get some steak, but I might have to get it from somewhere else because they don't... I want New York strip. Huh? <laughs> yeah, I'm not going to get the steak from here. Uh, only because I don't see the what I'm looking for. Alright, so I guess we'll head out to check out. I need some scallions, some green onions. Let's see if we can find those real quick. Yeah. Alright, so we are heading to check out now. Uh, we bought some Malta to try some Malta. I'll show you guys what we got when we get home in the grand total. We're in line right now checking out. I'm back home now. I parked under a tree at the meat store. We was in the store for like 15, no more than 20 minutes. And check this out. disrespectful ass birds y'all <laughs> they shit at all of my car on, <laughs> on the window everywhere and on the back of the car as well look at this look this shit everywhere look at this nasty boo boo I'm sorry, the reflection in the window is horrible. I'm trying to show y'all the poop. They just disrespectful. Poop everywhere. All right, so I'm going to unbag this stuff and show y'all what we got, how much of everything we got in the grand total, and how I put it away. Be back. Okay, so this is what we have here. Um, this was $50. This is very expensive these are chicken wings that's 10 pounds of whole chicken wings they were 4.99 a pound 50 dollars. that's a lot for some chicken but i know the prices of the chicken have gone up so for 10 pounds of ground beef it was 28 dollars and 23 cents uh, a couple of bell peppers i grabbed 11 pounds of chicken thighs and this was 11.35 I grabbed this for the kids. It's some jelly fruit. It's like little mini jellos. So I thought this was cute. They like these anyway. Normally I got them in a little small netted bag, but this was $6.99. We bought these little things because they looked interesting. We want to try these. And these were $2.00. We got some peanuts. I'm gonna make some boiled peanuts. I'm gonna put them in the crock pot and let them cook and probably put some, maybe some shrimp and some smoked meat in there with it. Those are really good. We got some malta. We want to try this too. And this malta was uh, $4.79. We got 10 pounds of whole chicken wings for $6.99. This was the one that was on special for buy five pounds, get five pounds free. Now we got five pounds of oxtails because my son has been asking for these. For five pounds of oxtails, it was $65.47. So this and the whole chicken wings were the most expensive things. And we got some pork chops. 10 pounds for $10.36. So the total of all of this stuff I just bought was 206. That is a lot. I don't have a whole lot of meat either. It's because of those whole chicken wings. That's $50 and the oxtails was $65. So for those two, it was $115 or something like that. So that was really expensive. Um, I still have to get more meat, like some steak and some other stuff that I would want us to have too. But I'm gonna go ahead and get this bagged and show you how I bag it and stuff. Alright, 
So these are just some freezer bags. I buy these at Walgreens and I buy one on sale. They have them buy one, get two free. The price is $2.79. So you buy, you get three of these for $2.79. Um, what I do is I label the bags with what I'm gonna put inside of it. Okay. That way we know what it is, especially when I send the kids in here to take something out. I'll be like, pull out one of them bags of ground beef so they know which one is which. So I'll do it this way. All right, I got everything bagged up and it's ready to go in the freezer. bags of food we good for a little while anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this video again if you haven't already go ahead and hit that subscribe button and i will see you guys in the next video bye for now